so hi everyone another day another ai model has dropped and this is a big release in the audio ai section where a new tts model that is dia 1.6 billion has been released and it is a conversational ai model so it's not just making text to speech but it is generating text to dialogues text to conversation with non verbal elements as well like for example if you mention laughs it will start laughing also so given the first examples the team has mentioned that it looks better than 11 labs and sesame csm 1b as well so you can easily take this model as the best open source tts model for conversational ai for now and when i was looking into the results also it is very very good talking about the languages supported for now it just supports english but i think as mentioned on the github they would be soon supporting other languages as well So let's see a few examples, and then in the same video we will be seeing how you can use the model for free in your local system or on Hugging Face Spaces as well. So let's get started. First of all, let's see this main page where they have covered the one point six billion and compared it with eleven labs as well as Sesame CSM one B. So let's get started. So this is the input script. The is an open with text to dialogue models S one S two S one S two. So these are the speakers. one thing very interesting mentioned in the 1.6 billion introduction is that it takes up random audios so it can generate any audio at time like it can be a male audio it can be a female audio it can be shrill it can be heavy it can generate random voices so that's the best part so let's test it out for the first prompt dia is an open weights text to dialogue model you get full control over scripts and voices wow amazing <laughs> try it now on github or hugging face Pretty impressive. Now let's try out the other one, Eleven Labs and Sesame. Dia is an open weight text to dialogue model. You get full control over scripts and voices. Wow, amazing! Ha <laughs> ha. Try it now on GitHub or Hugging Face. Dia is an open weight um, text to dialogue model. You get full control over scripts and voices. Wow, amazing! Ha <laughs> ha. Try it now on GitHub or Hugging Face. As I'm mentioning, that note that Eleven Labs and Sesame models don't have the ability to transcribe laughter tags into speech. We replace laughs with ha ha. So in this case, for the uh, laughs works, but for the case of Eleven Labs and Sesame, it would have uttered it as laughs. So it was not able to take it as it is. So ha ha is mentioned explicitly, as you can see in their prompts. Now let's see another example. Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good. Pretty good. What about you? Etc. Let's try out the one point six B here as well. Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good, pretty good. What about you? I'm great. So happy to be speaking to you. Me too. This is some cool stuff, huh? Yeah, I have been reading more about speech generation. Yeah, and it really seems like context is important. Definitely. This is very nice, to be honest. I think the clarity is just spot on, and I'm really started liking the one point six B now. Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good. Pretty good. What about you? I'm great. So happy to be speaking to you. Me too. This is some cool stuff, huh? Yeah, I have been reading more about speech generation. Yeah. And it really seems like context is important. Definitely. I think Eleven Labs is also quite decent, but at points it it sounds a bit mechanical. Uh, here they've mentioned that Sesame One B model output is significantly worse compared to the audio provided as an example on the website. So the one point six team is mentioning the Sesame is not as good as mentioned. So let's test out both the examples here. The website example is this one. Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good, pretty good. What about you? I'm great. So happy to be speaking to you. Me too. This is some cool stuff, huh? Yeah, I've been reading more about speech generation. Yeah. And it really seems like context is important. Definitely. So this was the website Sesame model, and this is the open source Sesame model. Hey. Amazing. Pretty good. Pretty good. What about you? I'm great. So I'm um, happy to be be speaking to you. Me too. This is some some cool stuff, huh? Yeah, I uh, like I have been reading more about speech generation. Yeah, and um, it really seems like context is important. Definitely. It's quite poor, to be honest. So I think, given the open source arena, the 1.6 B looks the absolute winner for conversational AI, and Sesame CSM 1B is looking a little off. There are a few more examples we can try out. 
that you can try out. I will be sharing this link with you. Here you can see these are long examples. They have the entire website is full of examples where they have covered a lot of things so that you can believe that the 1.6 is actually quite good. Now let's move on to the different section. How to use this model for free. So the team has deployed a free hugging face space where you can just input your text. S1, S2 represents the speaker and eventually you can just generate audio from here. There are other examples also that team has mentioned. Let's pick out one of them. Let's pick this one. So this is the one. Let's try to generate. The processing time it looks quite okay. I think 20 seconds is fine given this longer text. Open with text to dialogue model. You get full control over scripts and voices. Hard to disagree laughs. I think this is something that I think Suno was also doing if you don't know Suno AI which now can generate uh, music as well. But this, this, uh, this particular section coming into open source model is quite interesting. Now let's listen to this audio. Open weights text to dialogue model. You get full control over scripts and voices. I'm biased, but I think we clearly won. Hard to disagree. <laughs> Thanks for listening to this demo. Try it now on GitHub and Hugging Face. If you liked our model, please give us a star and share to your friends. This was Nari Labs. A little fast, I would say. I think there was just no space. So one glitch I can see is that the audio is quite fast when you're using the actual model. Those were the examples. Now let me show you the code how to run this model for free on Google Collab also. So here is the code you can see. Very short. You just need to turn on your T4 GPU that is free as you can see. First step is to pip install dia.git as you can see here and then the rest of the code is quite easy. Sound file as sf dia.model you are loading dia 1.6b and here is the text that I provided it. S1 my new book on model context protocol is coming soon. Yes this is an announcement. It covers all the beginner basics. Wow amazing laughs. And here I have tried adding one more element sneezes. Let's see what it generates because in most of the examples they are using just laughs. So let's see. This is the sound frequency. So let me play this audio that I generated. My new book on model context protocol is coming soon. <sighs> Covers all beginner basics. Wow. Amazing. <laughs> It was quite good to be honest. I think sneezing it did something else but still pretty good I would say. I think worth trying out the model looks amazing and given such a powerful model as open source may means a lot uh, and you cannot generate any sort of podcast I can say or any sort of dialogues just free of cost. I think the model size is very small and you should be able to run on your CPU also if you have decent enough RAM. Might be slow but you should be able to manage this. So with this it's a wrap. I think the 1.6 TTS looks to be the best TTS model for now and worth trying out. Thank you so much.